Hello my beauties, how's everyone doing? If you are new here, my name is Zonaza and I welcome you to my channel Life with Zonaza. Here we talk all things femininity, fashion, beauty, style, lifestyle, faith, you name it, we are on it. I hope you'll find something that you love here and become part of this fast growing family of beauties by hitting the subscribe button down below and the notification bell so that you don't miss out on any of my new videos. To my returning beauties, welcome back. It is lovely to see you again. On today's video, we are doing my first Shein haul for the year 2022. I'm really excited about this one. I was intentional with the pieces that I was picking because I only just recently went back to work full time. So I needed pieces that I can easily wear to work, but can also wear on outings such as lunches and dinners. They are flowy fabrics that are feminine and soft just as we love to keep it on this channel so without wasting any time let's jump straight into today's video the first item that we're looking at today is this satin blouse it has buttons this time around they are nice and covered up if you remember sometime last year on one of the hauls i've done i think it was yellow sub i was complaining about the cheap looking buttons i was really happy to see this one on shein because i love covered buttons it gives that vintage classy look that you will see from our mothers and grandmothers you will see that they were stylish and classy with these items so i love it when a shirt has those this is the outfit that i tried the shirt on with i'm wearing it with jeans that i got from denim by natty k on instagram they sent me a few pairs of jeans to try on and this one was my favorite one it is a bit big I'm, I'm losing some weight because you know a girl has been working doing some things eating better but this is the general idea of how i like to wear these smart shirts it can easily work for office if you're the kind of person that will wear jeans to the office but you can also just switch up the jeans for formal pants i have black pants and brown pants that i can easily wear this with otherwise this is a classic shirt that i love that i feel is not even that much trendy it is a shirt that i will have for a very long time the quality is perfectly fine there is no stretch to the fabric i highly highly recommend the top if anyone is wondering you can try it like i said with maybe a skirt with some pants to make it a bit more formal but i went with it with some jeans and my favorite mules from zara the handbag is also from shein i got it last year so that is outfit number one which is more on the casual and relaxed side of things please let me know what do you think of this outfit what would you rock this blouse or shirt with please comment on the comment section down below that is outfit number one done and dusted looking into outfit number two this one right here <laughs> the reason i'm laughing about this it is a crop polo style knit top which is printed and you will get the full description from shein about it i got it in the size us6 uk 38 size medium i'm a size 34 so i always go for medium on the Shein page. Now, the issue is not really an issue profile. <laughs> I saw some trending pictures of this top, and by the time I saw these, I had already bought the item, so it was already on its way to me. They were saying that this top uh, looks like it's a Makosa item, and Laduma is gonna come for those guys like it did with Zara, but guys, how does this resemble my closer? Like, I don't see it. I've never seen, for example, my closer with floral prints, which this is like, it's, it's hearts that are forming a flower. 
and they are <laughs> pearls guys i don't i don't see it if you see it then you see it but i don't see it i love the top so <laughs> so this is <laughs> anyway i've met laduma in the past and we know a lot of people and i was surprised that he knows me so i would never do anything to intentionally buy something that is a dupe of his original work which i'm actually hoping to buy soon now why would i just go and do that guys come on <laughs> can we just live not everything is about being copying and all that okay enough about the rambling i love the top i am wearing it with another sheen item this is the lovely skirt i am keeping it rolled up oh i love skirts like this because i wear them casual i hardly wear these with say heels and make it extra i like to wear these with flat shoes and this is the outfit that i put together with the top the famous <laughs> polo top i've paired these together and i'm wearing it with some sandals this can work for lunch for me or a friday at the office because we take things easy at the office on fridays with the skirt i will wear this sometimes with just a plain bodysuit or a plain white t-shirt i can also wear it maybe with a white shirt and some block heel to make it more smart but right now because i wanted to put it together with one of the items that i got from this sheet in haul as you can see that's the look i think this is my favorite look out of this entire haul i don't know maybe it's too soon to say but i really loved how cute and effortless this is it's giving just chilled vibes but put together it's not a common look that's a definite sure sure i have not seen anyone putting together these two i love that it is my own idea though i steal a lot of ideas from pinterest and instagram but this one i didn't see anywhere else i just put it together quick question though what do you think of this apollo do you think it resembles my closet by la Duma? <laughs> guys please comment in the comment section down below and if you are loving the direction this whole haul is taking please hit the subscribe button now if you had not hit it yet next up we are looking at this lovely satin dress oh love 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 this dress i bought last year in the color olive green i just love how it fits my body i've worn that one way too many times so i wanted something similar but obviously in a different color i truly truly enjoy wearing this it's nice and beautiful you can wear a t-shirt underneath the dress or a white shirt over it i talked about how you can wear a satin slip dress on one of my videos last year i will link it here and you can have a look and try those different looks but right here i have paired it with my cream off white blazer from the fix i thoroughly enjoyed this look this is actually the look that inspired me to put on some red lipstick because when i was trying on the dress and i was wearing red lipstick on the day i was like yeah this can work so that's why i decided to just put on red lipstick for this entire video which i hardly ever do what do you think of my red lips this is ruby woo by the way so that is the full look i thoroughly thoroughly enjoy this look this is perfect for a lunch with the girls or even date night with your man it's a stunning stunning look and i'm not wearing a bra here i could not find any of my half bras so i'm really sorry for anything that might be a little bit off but you can see how the look comes together are you subscribed yet have you rated the video up just yet <laughs> before we go on to the next outfit okay here's the next item hey everything is just such and such and do you ever do some shopping and notice that you literally bought the same thing <laughs> same energy same flow that is what happened with me on this one and i picked the items over a few days but i just found myself gravitating more towards similar looking items and i don't have a lot of neutrals in my wardrobe but contrary to what is currently happening on the style 
streets i'm noticing that there's a lot of color coming back into trend and i've been wearing color i've just been one of those people that have been resistant just wearing color even at the time when everyone was going for neutral so this is the skirt it's a classic animal print skirt why am i looking cute like this oh here i must hide under the skirt this whole time <laughs> i'm joking guys why do i just ramble for no reason anyway so this is the beautiful stunning skirt with a flared bottom like this it's so girly it's so grown woman vibe you know it says i'm a lady i know what i want out of life and i also bought this black bodysuit racer back i bought this in white last year and i loved it so much so i got this one but the mistake i made i didn't double check the fabric i just went by the cut of the bodysuit which is similar to the one i got last time hi well guys this whole time i forgot to take this thing off now and i'm filming i see it peeping through i hope it didn't interrupt my other videos but anyway i mean the other parts back to business this is the bodysuit the last one i got was in the more of a cycling scuba fabric but this one is in cotton i'm a little disappointed but i don't know how it's going to perform however i must wear it because you can't return um, bodysuits and underwears back to shein and i also don't like doing returns because you are expected to pay for the shipping back so i just try to avoid return this is the outfit it's very simple it's very classic i will always have this on my cupboard in future i'll be wearing the skirt with a shirt a turtleneck as well this is gonna look stunning with a black or a white turtleneck in the colder days and maybe a coat over it or a trench this can also work with sneakers i love wearing like feminine pieces and just relaxing them with something flat and a bit casual that i usually would but on this actual video and outfit i have it on with some black pointy shoes from mr price i love these they're comfortable they're light and they are really affordable i think i got them for like 200 bucks or a little less than 200 bucks i like them and i accessorized with some gold earrings and a gold neck piece truly enjoy this look a black handbag would go great with this sometimes you are looking for something to style the outfits and it's just not popping and you are putting everything together so if you do like the look and want to give it a try it will look stunning with a black handbag on can you see how grown i look in this like <laughs> with this black bodysuit i also got it in beige as well but i'm not showing any outfits with it here yeah, i'm just telling you just so you know that it's another it's another color to consider and the beige one actually came in the fabric that i wanted which is the more cycling tights fabric that i like please rate the video and comment down below what your thoughts are about this outfit and this one has to be my least favorite outfit of all those outfits i don't know something is just not coming together and i tried it with so many other items i was actually even hesitant to put it on this video this is the top it's another neat polo but in one solid color i've been seeing this and loving it on pinterest lots of girls wearing this up and down but i don't know when i put it on i don't know maybe it's a lot bigger than i thought it's just not giving what i thought it would give i wanted it to give a relaxed but not t-shirt casual i don't know if i'm making sense but just something i can wear and make smart but i tried it with everything it just wasn't coming together i'm gonna buy maybe some bermuda shots and see how it looks the pair i have right now it didn't work because it's light blue baby blue ice blue i don't know i just didn't like how that looked so just ignore the jeans here i, I really didn't know how to do this i really those jeans are old and worn out i don't know but i'm just showing you the top right here it is it's a beautiful top i'm open to suggestions on the comment section down below of 
what would you pair this with to give it oomph because i feel it's just so basic on the outfit i have on i don't know guys but i'm not gonna do anything to it i'm gonna keep it i still feel like this is something i can work with i don't know with what in future i will look up some ideas but i will keep it i'm not gonna not gonna return it or sell it or anything like that because sometimes i do sell some of the stuff i don't want just to avoid having to ship stuff back let's see how things go i don't know for now <laughs> the fabric is just so nice even the stretch it's nice and it feels expensive even though it is not expensive so i'll still keep it definitely um yeah i am trying to convince myself about something that i bought that's not working out <laughs> Either way, before we go on to the last outfit, the earrings I have on, stunning gold, obviously full gold earrings that I have on, and other pairs that I have on during the try-ons are also from Shein. They are so cheap, I could not believe my eyes, but I do have sensitive ears, so I can't wear them for too long. They look like some of the ones that are at Lovisa, but at a much cheaper price, so I highly recommend them. I'll put them here. You can check them out and add them onto whatever stuff you are buying from Shein at the moment write the video up if you are enjoying the outfits so far have you seen anything that you will be buying as well from Shein? please comment on the comment section down below and now to look at the second last outfit that we are covering for today's video is this gorgeous 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 mint green is it mint green or olive green it has a nice green tone to it and i messed it up with some makeup that's what you get for taking on something taking it off only to try something else because you would not think much of this dress when you just see it there on the website until you see it on i saw the potential on that picture i was like uh -uh, this can work for me and you can trust she in for the perfect fit this goes right into my waist perfectly and lets me go where I need to be let go. It knows all the right places to hold and let go. I love the ruched detail on the neck. It's a turtleneck vibe. This is so beautiful. I love it. I love it. I have no complaints about it. I did not include it on this haul. I don't know what happened when I first filmed the other outfits only to think about it again as i'm filming so you almost missed this one it also has a bit of a flat bottom part here which is more of an a-line than the average flare there it is here there's nothing really it didn't need anything well maybe it could have used some supportive tummy sucking item which i did not have at the time of filming i just really needed to make sure that i get this done today because filming time now has gotten really tight like i said i have gone back to work so if you see anything that's a bit off about the production of this video just know it's due to that I'm pushing letters i'm taking whatever little time that i get to squeeze in a video because i love my beauties i love this channel and you have been really supportive to it for a long time so i can't just up and leave like that because i don't have a nanny i don't have the time <laughs> so yeah without any rambling that is the look i just feel it makes me look like my mom back in the 80s man i just get that vibe classic beauty vintage feel i once read somewhere that um shoulder pads make you look masculine i don't get that vibe here maybe that applies to maybe something with a long sleeve if maybe this top for example had puffed shoulders or a jacket but as for this dress i don't see any of this i love i love love this dress before i go this is the last last look that we are covering on this video it's this gorgeous top guys you know how i always do this i will always end off of film the whole video with my favorite item out of the entire haul i know when i'm sitting down it's not giving what it's supposed to have give but as you can see right here honey 
honey i love 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 this top it's also giving those vintage vibes i love old people clothes guys this is just stunning it has this beautiful sleeves here but it creases a lot i ironed this before putting it on i ironed it before trying it on but gee you will just see creases keep coming keep going but i love it i don't care about the creasing i love the sleeve guys i feel like it's giving pinterest it's giving fantasy it's giving my femininity it's giving a sweet vibe it gives love a flow it gives light <laughs> I'm wearing it here with my very old Woolworths cream pants. I love these pants. I've had them for years and I would always keep going back because they just fit everything. They are not high-waisted. They are just average length. So I think this can work with high-waisted jeans, high-waisted pants. I do have other cream or high-waisted pants, but I just didn't like how the crotch looked. So I ended up going for these. And this is the look with the gold earrings. Like it's it's just <laughs> so obviously you can tell this is my favorite item out of this entire haul. Always try to get value for money in the items that I buy. I don't buy things just to kill time. I have no money to play like that, especially post-COVID. I saw one of the comments on a haul video that I did sometime last year, someone was saying hauls promote excessive lifestyles, you know, just buying things. But guys, we do need clothes and I don't buy clothes all the time. I try to keep it reasonably priced because I also have other things to look at, but it's a passion of mine. I love styling items. Sometimes I sell the stuff that I feel is no longer working for me or give it to charity so please don't guilt trip me about a smaller nyana she in haul i don't appreciate such comments guys if you don't want to buy clothes don't buy clothes but don't try to make me feel guilty for buying clothes and i didn't mean to leave this video on a sour note but yeah that is the last item that we're looking at on today's video and now to do a quick recap of the outfits that we covered today with that said we have reached the end of this video thank you so much for watching please subscribe and don't forget to share this video if you watched it and enjoyed it god bless you i love you